Hi everybody, this is Laura and Theo and today we're going to read, what are we reading? Can you remember the name of the book? Five Minutes Peace. So this is about a family of elephants called the Large Family and they get up to lots of stuff, don't they Theo? Yeah. So there they all are. There's Mama. So the children were having breakfast. This was mm. not a pleasant sight. What are they doing, Theo? Mess. Mess. They made a big mess at breakfast, didn't they? Look at the kitchen. I'm sure nobody's kitchen in Bob Riggan looks like that. I don't think so. So, the mammy is called. Can you remember her name? No. Mrs. Large. So, Mrs. Large took a tray from the cupboard. She set it with a teapot, a milk jug, her favourite cup and saucer, a plate of marmalade toast and a leftover cake from yesterday. Oh, that sounds like a good breakfast, didn't it? What was your breakfast today? Brown cakes. Brown cakes. She stuffed the morning paper into her pocket and she sneaked towards the door. Look, would everybody like to see her breakfast? Yes, that's Yummy. nice, isn't it? Yummy. Where are you going with that tray, Mum? asked Laura. To the bathroom, said Mrs. Large. What did the children ask? Why? Children always ask why. Why? Because I want five minutes peace, said Mrs. Large. That's why. Of course she did. Can we come? asked Lester as they trailed up the stairs behind her. Naughty. So what did Mum say? Could they go? What did she say? No. Said Mrs. Large. You can't. What shall we do then, asked Laura. You can play, said Mrs. Large. Downstairs, by yourselves, and keep an eye on the baby. What did the baby say? Mm. I am not a baby. He's not a baby anymore, said the little one. Mrs. Large ran a deep, hot bath. She emptied half a bottle of bath foam into the water. She plunked on her bath hat and she got in. She poured herself a cup of tea. She lay back with her eyes closed. It was heaven. There she is. Would everybody like to see? Oh, that looks good, doesn't it? Can I play you my tune? Asked Lester. Mrs. Large opened one eye. Must you? She asked. I've been practicing, said Lester. You told me to. Can I please just for one minute? Go on then, sighed Mrs. Large. So Lester played. Can you remember what Lester played? Twinkle, twinkle. Very good. Lester played Twinkle, Twinkle, Little Star. How many times did he play it? Do you know? Three and a half. Three and a half times. Oh, who's next? In comes Laura. Can I read you a page from my reading book? She asked. No, Laura, said Mrs. Large. Go on, all of you, off downstairs. You let Lester play his tune, said Laura. I heard you like him better than me. It's not fair. Oh, don't be silly, Laura, said Mrs. Large. Go on then, one page. So Laura read. She read four and a half pages of Little Red Hood. Riding Hood. Very good. In came the little one with a trunk full of toys. For you, he beamed, flinging them all into the bathwater. Thank you, dear, said Mrs. Large. Weekly. Look at her. Mrs. Large in the bath. Oh my goodness me. Oh, can I see the cartoons in the paper? asked Laura. Can I have the cake? asked Lester. Can I get in with you? asked the little one. Mm. Mrs. Large groaned. In the end, they all got in. The little one was in such a hurry that he forgot what he'd get to, Alexander. Here comes Alexandra. Can you sit here beside me? Can you remember what he forgot to do? He forgot to take off his pajamas. Oh my God, he jumped into the bath in his gym jammies. Oh my goodness. So what did Mrs. Large do? Mrs. Large got out. She got out. She dried herself. She put on her dressing gown and she headed for the door. Where I are have you going? You have a blue dressing gown like that, you do. Where are you going now, Mum? asked Laura. To the kitchen. Why? Because I want five minutes what? Five peace. minutes peace. That's why. 
So off she went downstairs, where she had three minutes and 45 seconds of peace before they all came to join her. And look, there's her three minutes there. They were a good three marmalade. minutes. There's marmalade everywhere, I know. And then they all came running. And the little one. And the little one. Don't forget the little one. There's the little one. Let me see the little There's one. There's the little one. Okay, what's everybody say? Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Thank you.